Yo, 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 what's going on guys? Your boy is Pilot 2K7 and today we are jumping into another episode of LSPDFR here in Grand Theft Auto 5 and we are going to be doing a FBI slash FIB patrol. So we are at the FIB building here. We have this awesome uniform here and I do have my vest on right now. The reason why I put on my vest is we actually have to do a high level prisoner transport today so we're gonna be transporting a very high level prisoner and um he's somebody that we arrested that we had to uh, arrest and we're pretty much gonna transport him from the los santos police up into the um department of corrections we're gonna take him to the boiling broke penitentiary now, there are some people that are going to try to get this guy out. They're going to try to break this guy out. So we're going to have to be on alert. We have to be on high alert today. We're going to have to make sure we are prepared. So as you can see, we are wearing our vests. We have our Tahoe. This is a new Tahoe by Gump. And this thing is awesome. I love the thin blue line option that's on the Chevy sign there in the back and in the front. And I decided to use this one in white and so um, sometimes you do see the government they do have white Tahoes as well so I figured let's, let's use some white Tahoes today instead of our traditional all black Tahoes so I'm gonna go ahead and jump in now this has a really nice all blue light set up here you can see this thing is awesome shout outs to Gump on this one I always love his vehicles whenever he releases a vehicle I'm always quick to download it so we have our traffic advisors back there add in your secondary lights as so and your full code 3 lights those things look awesome I'm loving the all blue I'm definitely gonna use this um, Tahoe some more but uh, yeah I'm enjoying this so let's go ahead and get ready to do our prisoner transport here so I'm gonna go ahead and radio the other units we're gonna go ahead and meet up with each other and transport our high-level prisoner to Los Santos so I mean to um, the penitentiary in Blaine County, so let's go ahead and get ready to go. We have a police transport requesting escort on Vespucci Boulevard. Hi right, guys, so we just got the call from dispatch. Um, the transport is pretty much ready. They are waiting for us, so we're going to go ahead and respond to the location. And um, let's see if we can meet up with the rest of the convoy and get this prisoner from Los Santos to the Bolingbroke Penitentiary guys so hopefully this will turn out to be a good episode if you guys do enjoy do remember to go ahead and smash that like button also leave a comment let me know if you guys enjoyed this video and let me know what you guys think of this awesome Tahoe as well also thank you guys for 89k we hit 89k yesterday 89 thousand subscribers and I thank each and every one of you guys for subscribing and watching my videos I really do appreciate it and thank you guys so so much all right so we're gonna head to the location we're gonna try to meet up with the rest of the units here Alright, so we're going to be taking them out of the Vespucci station. And I'm actually going to go through the other entrance just because that entrance doesn't always open up properly. So let's just go into the main entrance on this side. Alright. And I'm loving these all blue lights here. I know the federal government, they don't use all blue. They normally have red and blue, at least where I live at. But um, I'm loving the all blue as well. Alright, so here is the bus. So we are parked in the standby zone here. And we have another Tahoe with us. I'm going to see if I can change it to white. Um, if not, I'll just let it be black. So let me get into the standby zone and let's get everything set up here. Alright. So let's. Oops. Let me get everything set up and then we're good to go. Alright, guys. So I was halfway through the whole transport mission when I realized I didn't record 
this whole part of after I set up the menu so I didn't realize until like five minutes before we were about to reach our destination so I figured I'll just start it all over from the beginning um, or whatever so let's go ahead and get this set up again let me make sure we are recording so we're gonna be transporting a high-level prisoner here and um, see so we're using this Tahoe here I think I'm gonna use the Suburban just because the siren won't stay on with the Suburban so let's use that alright so we have Ramsey Howell he sent us for seven years in jail for aggregated unmurdered unpermitted use of pyrotechnics okay so basically he like tried to bomb something so as you can see we have the Department of Corrections we have LSPD SWAT he actually has two LSPD SWAT officers one's driving and one's armed with an advanced rifle we also have the Department of Corrections officer armed with an advanced rifle as well so let's go ahead and try to get them to the boiling broke penitentiary as fast as possible there's a high risk of people trying to break this guy out so we want to definitely make sure we get him out of here so what I'm going to do I'm just going to drive out of here and press shift Y to reset the convoy and we are good okay, so right now his risk level is a medium but that could change so let's just try to get him to where he has to go as fast as possible here. I really cannot believe I did not press record. I mean, it does happen. This isn't the first time it happened to me, so probably won't be the last. Whoa, my God, where are you guys going? All right. So if you notice, the threat level on the top left has just went to high. So we have to be on high alert here definitely want to check all of these vehicles driving near us. A red car is coming up pretty fast on us. Speed up, speed up. I'm going to spend a lot of time looking backwards just because I have to make sure the convoy is okay. I wish they could speed up a little faster here. And the last one we got attacked right here. And it was crazy because Oh shoot, actually that is where we got attacked. They're still here. So those are the guys that attacked us last time when I forgot to hit record. <laughs> so as you can see we took care of them. Alright, threat level went back down to a medium. All of these cars speeding up are freaking me out here. Yep, here they go right here. I used my MP5 last time. This is so freaking dangerous. We have a problem? Oh, whoa, yes, we do have a problem. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. They're trying to attack the convoy. All right, everybody, get back inside. We got FBI here. This is crazy. One thing I wish is that the driver would stay in the vehicle because if the driver dies, then I gotta drive the 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 bus, and I don't want to drive the bus. All right, we're clear. Everybody's clear. We okay? All right, get back in the vehicle, guys. I'll cover you guys. Get back in. Get back in. Let me double check to make sure we're recording again. All right, you get back in the suburban. Everybody's good. Everybody's good. Corrections guy, are you getting back in the bus or are you going to stay here? I think he's going to get back in the bus. Alright. So he's getting back in. Alright, so we have been attacked. Let's go ahead and hightail it out of here now. Perfect, perfect. Alright, let me clear this intersection up here. Alright, perfect. Definitely want to make sure you 
clear the intersections for the motorcade as well. I may do this with a motorcycle. Let me know if you guys would like to see that. That would be pretty cool. I wish it lets you go further ahead so you can like kind of leapfrog. Like actually block off traffic. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, shoot. <laughs> there we go. Hey. Oh, shoot. Risk level went up to high again. Every time we get onto the highway, the risk level is really high. Alright, let's keep this thing moving in here. What's that motorcycle doing there? That motorcycle looks a little suspicious. Come on, convoy. Speed it up, speed it up, speed it up. Damn, they're getting so far by, behind. They're hitting so many people. Alright guys, we are almost there. We are so close. Damn, they're just driving so damn slow. Come on guys, we gotta keep the motorcade moving. Rule number one, the motorcade stops for nothing. Once we stop, we're a sitting duck, guys. It would be cool if he could eventually update this and make it so that we have, like, larger convoys. That would be awesome. Whoa. Last time I felt like the bus was driving so much faster. Alright, we're almost there guys. Y'all should, yeah, should have saw the one, the one I recorded before this. We were freaking flying. The bus was actually driving faster than me. For some reason it glitched out and the bus pretty much drove himself there. I got a Blaine County Sheriff. Let me just clear out this route right here. Turn. Perfect. No, oh, where are you going? They're not going to follow me here either. 
Oh, he actually did. Alright, we should be home sweet home after this. Alright, this is a final stretch. So happy we got it right. Whoa, what is LSPD doing up here? Now I'm just going to go ahead and make sure the whole route is secure and hasn't been compromised. <laughs> there goes the last bus. Look how fast it was driving. That's the last bus that we escorted here. I guess he's doing laps now. Alright, so let's go into the waiting area. And now we just have to wait. Make sure he gets out. We're going to be handing him over to the Department of Corrections here. Now, I did want to have the backup unit be a Tahoe, but it just didn't let me. Whoa. Just because of the way the I&I &I file is set up. But yeah, we have completed this mission twice. <laughs> Thankfully, it worked out okay on the second time. So I hope you guys did enjoy this episode here. Thank you guys for watching. And um, yeah, let me know what else you want to see. I think I may do this again with a motorcycle maybe. Let me know if you guys think that is a good idea. And um, yeah, guys, thank you guys for watching. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.